Bro, you're camping inside a house. You're literally camping under the roof, bro, in a realistic one we want. And in today's video, I'm gonna try out all the most popular stretch resolutions out there and give you my most honest feedback about them. I'm also trying to point out all the positive and negative aspects of each stretch resolution. And please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to help me out the best way possible. And with that said, let's get straight into this topic. And yeah guys, as you can see right now here already on screen, for the first resolution we're going to try out 1440x1080, which is literally the best resolution for max FPS and the least amount of input delay. Oh my god bro, this is so stretch literally. Okay, where even the realistics over here, I guess. Bro, this looks so weird, I swear. Holy freak. Okay, I guess we're gonna go for something like box fight loot because we want to have a guaranteed space, you know. And we have a default skin. Oh my god, no way. Oh my god, guys, I swear, literally 1440 times 1080. It looks so weird. Like, I can't even build properly, bro. Okay. Come on, bro. Oh my god, bro. This feels so weird. Oh my god. Oh my god, shit on. Okay, okay, I take it. Okay, minus 40. Okay, shit quick. And dead, okay. Just like that. Wait, where's he going? Bro, where are you going? Bro, what? Okay, hit him. Okay, shit cracked. No, bro! <laughs> okay, this res is literally so weird. I can't even lie there. This feels so weird to play on. No, he left! I think my eyes can't handle this. And if you don't really need it for FPS benefits, really don't play on it. It's not that great, guys. Like, literally everything feels so much slower. Like, as you can see, if I move around like once on my mousepad, this, this looks like freaking slow motion bro <laughs> and yeah here we are right now guys the next resolution is 1680 times 1050 which should be the closest to actually like native resolution and we're just going to do exactly the same thing hop into creative into some realistic one we want and then just see how it works boys and yeah guys as expected this is pretty much straight up native resolution we're just gonna get like all the benefits of having a stretch resolution you know like more fps less input delay and yeah just see how we can actually frag now Okay, bro. Cool, sorry. Let's check him. Okay. Okay, that's free, I would say. And yeah, as expected, guys, nothing too crazy there. This is straight up native resolution. Like, I don't even know. My teammate is camping inside a house in a realistic 2v2. Bro, you're camping inside a house. You're literally camping under the roof, bro, in a realistic 1v1. Bro, you're literally camping in the house. There's no way he's going for the flopper play, right? He's not gonna outheal him just simply or. Bro, there's no way my teammate is out healing someone in a realistic. There's no way, literally. There's no way. Please, please don't tell me there's a thing. Wait, he lost it. Yeah, he lost. He lost it. Bro. Bro, what am I seeing? He left. He rage quitted. He left. He left. Shit on. Let's go, boys. Yeah, I mean, this is literally everything I have to tell about this resolution, guys. This is straight up just your normal native resolution with a little bit less input delay. So if you're playing on native, maybe try to consider to switch over to this resolution because it's really good in my opinion. 
And yeah guys, now for the final part of today's video, we're going to try out 1750 x 1080 which is literally straight up the best resolution in competitive Fortnite at the moment. And yeah, see you guys just in a second again in creative. Oh my god, finally guys, my normal resolution. I literally love this resolution so much. So we're of course gonna go from box fight loot because we wanna have a spice, you know, otherwise it's not really that much fun. Okay, we have a bunch of sweats here in our lobby as it seems. They got some pretty sweaty skin combos. And I'm just gonna go into team 2 now. Oh damn bro, come on, come on. Bro, hope it just ran. I mean, yeah, okay. I didn't expect this, but I guess, okay, why not? Okay, bro. Oh, come on, bro. I want to pickaxe him. Come on, please. I mean, yeah, okay guys, I'm just gonna blend you in some other clips where I already played with 1750 times 1080 but it was like with my keyboard cam and not like face cam, you know, so it's a little bit less entertaining, I do believe, but yeah, I'm just gonna roll some clips there. What the fuck am I seeing, boys? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bro, okay, 1750 times 1080 is goaded, guys, I'm not gonna lie there. Bro! Bro! What am I seeing? <laughs> oh my fucking- Nah, there's no way he's so lucky! Please shit on him, bro. Bro, just spray, just spray, literally spray, please. Oh no. Ah, oh, no, bro, that hurts. Okay. Yeah, boys. <laughs> 1750 times 1080, definitely good rest, boys. Definitely 100%. And as a final conclusion guys, I can only say that there's a huge noticeable difference between playing on a stretch resolution versus native. You definitely notice that you have way less input delay and more FPS, which is really cool in my opinion. If you're maybe not really used to stretch resolution, try to go for something like 1680 x 1050, which is the closest to native, you know, it doesn't look as weird as all the other resolutions. But for me, the best sweet spot is definitely 1750 x 1080, which is the best resolution in competitive Fortnite at the moment. And if you're just simply trying to go for max FPS and the max performance, obviously try 14 40 times 1080. It's gonna look a little bit weird in the first place, but I think you guys could get used to it. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. This would help me out so, so much. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.